What's going on you guys? Alright, so I'm back here for another reaction video to another episode of MLP, so let's go. Of course, Rainbow Dash is happy about this. Sure, Rain Rainbow Dash just loves the love and support she gets from Scoots. Whoa, whoa, wait. What's going on here? So it looks like I think Scoots may be more excited about this club than the one she just got done with going over. So I wonder how many members she's going to get for this washout club. I wonder if they're going to have different lyrics for the next uh, My Little Pony intro. And I hope they use a different group picture. I think I probably said that in my last reaction video. Oh, hey, Scootaloo. I was just in the neighborhood. Oh, what's this? Oh, hey, did I interrupt your fan club meeting? Hey, what are you doing here? I could have you. Don't lie, Scoots. Yes, you are. You know, Rainbow Dash, you can go in yourself. And Scoots, you still have m other washout decorations up. Alright, at least Scoots is being honest. That's a cute fangirl face, though. But she's got the cool Sonic Rainbow. Bad Rainbow Dash feels bad that she's looking up to some pony elf. Looks like. Wonder how the rest of the Wonder Bolts would feel about this. Yeah, don't fake, don't lie. Yeah, good. Call. She's right there. It was a good call trying to keep it down on the height for them. Alright, looks like they've got a good crowd going. Let's see how it's a rip-off, or if it is or not. Hello! The Wonderbolts have bleachers, too! We practically invented sitting on bleachers. Ugh. Invented. Popcorn and cotton candy! Rip-off! Sounds like a kind of a cool intro song here.
That's a cool intro for them. Let's see who, what they all look like without their uh, helmets or uniforms on. So it looks like Artie's a little concerned about this. <laughs> that pouty swooned at that wink. Oh wow. <laughs> All right, I recognize the color of that po the pony's fur and tail. <gasps> oh wow, she really got the crowd there. Alright, so now they're doing autograph signing. Is that necessary, RD? <laughs> huh. Wait, Scoots wants to join? No, I mean literally, join the club. We're called the washouts because we all used to be wonder bolts just like you. Until we washed out. No way! Yep, <sighs> name's Rolling Thunder. I got booted out of Wonderbolt Academy because of flagrant disregard for hazardous weather. If doing barrel rolls through 900 million volts of electricity in a raging thunderstorm is wrong, then I am one of you right. Cool. <laughs> this is short fuse. Not listening to you. So Artie's still smi- I mean, Scoots is still smiling. Oh. Uh, okay. So that body was really hating there. Only the most reckless ex wonder bowl of all. All right, let's see who this other member is. Oh, yeah. Lightning dust. Rainbow dust. Lightning dust. The one where they cut off because lightning dust was careless. It's a careless wonder bolt and only thought about herself back in season three. Because she got kicked out of the Wonder Bolts. She deserved it, though. Question is, uh, is it working? Come on, you know you miss me. Me and her, we blew every pony out of the sky. And Rainbow Dash wasn't too happy about that. Really? All that wind was totally dangerous. We had fun, right? Two fastest times on the Divitron. If I remember correctly, I had you beat by half a second. Only because when I win, I cranked up the dizziness factor. <laughs> well, I'm glad it all worked out. Your show was pretty dynamite. Want to know the secret? We basically ignore everything the Wonder Bulls ever taught us about safety. Well, we do have safety rules for a reason. True. Listen, kid. All their rules were just ways of keeping 
<laughs> the way she did this with her wing. I love how they try to make use wings like hands sometimes. Sure, it looked like his leg got There's a bit hurt there. Let's see. Yeah, it looks like Scoots wants to join. Yeah, I don't know if Artie's gonna be. No, you're not her mommy, Scoot. Artie. True, she didn't join a Wonderbolt. Again, Artie, you're not her mommy. I don't think she's gonna give a crap about lightning dust. About her saying hi. Yeah, I don't know. Looks like Scoot's not interested. Well, it looks like Spitfire's really going off on Scoots there. Yo, Spit, chill. Although I do like those shades on Spit, Fire. It is not that serious. You could just tell her normally, Spit. That does look like a cold Wonderbolt hat. <laughs> Sorry, that was a little intense. I just want to make sure you don't get hurt. That oh, that's a good call there, RD. Everybody's dream, right? More like follow your wing flaps. Same difference. <laughs> Thanks, super talented flyer, for clearing up what I should do. Clearing things up is one of my specialties. Now, come on. Let's go rip up all your wash out posters and yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. Or Scoots doesn't want it. Probably. I don't know if this is helping Artie's case. Oh wow, they have, looks, did they? I don't know, looks like they have an extra part to the treehouse, I don't know. No, no. And it looks like Twilight wanted their art autograph. Uh, true. Correct. Twilight? Yeah, Twilight somewhat gave that lesson to Pinky uh, back in season one. Maybe you're right, but this isn't about me. 
that transition. Looks like we got a really hot headed one here. Just as hot headed as Spitfire was earlier in this episode. You don't have to. <laughs> Yeah, it looks like Twilight should step in and help out. <laughs> and is it one of them? Although Scoots does look kind of kind of good in it. And Scoots is a handicapped Pegasus pony, though, too. No, it doesn't. No! Scoots, you've got... Scoots has got the outfit on now. Correct. So, so let's how sh see how she does. The question is, will she be safe doing it? Is she gonna be okay? Half off for princesses. That sounds like a good deal. So it looks like Twilight might be concerned with Scoots doing this. Good call there, Artie. Oh wow, that was cool. The way she used the, the little point top of her mane to eat it, throw it into her mouth like that. That was kind of cool there. Wow, that guy, whoever that announcer is, he's doing a great job. And those are some cool helmets too. You know, a while back, I actually did make an OC, didn't give it a name, but I made an OC with this kind of outfit and that kind of helmet on. Yeah, I don't think Lightning gives a flying feather about it. Or I guess she does. So, let's see if Scoots can handle this. I guess there's no fun in that for Scoots. No, Lightning, you should kind of consider Scoots' concerns. Because it looks like Spit or Lightning don't really give a flying feather about this. No, no Lightning. Lightning's being inconsiderate of, of this, her concerns. Yeah, I bet Artie's going to come in and, yep, there she is. Doing what, yeah, what lightning should have done. That doesn't mean I can't swoop in and save you from time to time. 
Oh, that's the good sisterly love I love to see between Artie and Scoot. Oh! Oh! What'd you say there? I'm glad Scoots is apologizing about that there. Good call there, Scoots. And good call there, Artie. Really love how they're bonding here. There, she's gonna make one for Scoots. Although I don't know if it should be in the treehouse, though. Well, there's another reaction video. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time, all right? All right, thanks, guys. All right, bye.